Hey guys, how's it going? My name is RGJ Runner, and welcome to The Lighthouse, a indie thriller game that will be coming out in August. And if you want to get the beta of this game, I will leave a link below to the Kickstarter. You must be a backer, to, however, to get this game. So, uh, yeah, if, if, if you like the game, if, if you want to get the game even, I think it's like $10, or no wait, no, it's $20, which isn't a lot. But one thing that does faze me about any indie games on Kickstarter is that they fade into obscurity after a few weeks or a few months. No one really gives a damn about them because I think it, the way they advertise these games is so wrong. They try to get bigger YouTubers to play them, but... I don't know, that's kind of putting all your eggs in one basket. I think maybe you should advertise on Twitter, Facebook. But then again, I'm not even sure if that would be the best marketing strategy, but it's got to be better than giving a free demo to PewDiePie, Markiplier, Jacksepticeye, Sky Does Minecraft, or whoever. But uh, yeah, either way, yeah, the premise of the game is you, you play as this detective turned private investigator called James Irvin. James Irvin leaves his work one day to visit his daughter's grave. However, before he leaves, he finds a mysterious note under his door, left by a woman who has a missing daughter and her last known location was in Maine. Uh, speaking of which, this missing girl also shares the same name as his own daughter, Lily. So there's a bit of a personal endeavor in it as well. So either way, I'll stop rambling on and I'll get right into it. Okay, play the. Wait, hold on. What check the settings first? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I suppose I'm getting a decent frame rate. Right, yeah, I have it on low. What if I turn it on to 1920? Ugh. That'll be okay. Oh god, that's spooky. Okay, F for flashlight. Okay, seriously, where the fuck did you get this flashlight from? Fucking Aldi? Little? The pound store? The dollar store? Or whatever equivalent of a dollar store, your store you have in whichever country this is in? Oh yeah, the US. Okay, yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. Hold on, just want to check my frame rate. Yeah, Jesus Christ. Alright, this is a little bit better, I think. Still a little laggy. I blame the CPU more than my graphics card. Okay, what do we have here? Ooh, spooky, and we also have some muddy footprints. Can we do some good investigations on these? No? Wait, hold on. The lighthouse seems to affect the scratches on the floor. Yeah, okie dokie. Uh, okay, we got a lamp here. Useless, okay, that's good. Good to know. And, oh, there's the lighthouse, okay. I can see and hear the lighthouse from this room. Oh, that's nice. Good for you, buddy. Oh, this is really creepy. Especially, uh... This painting here. Oh, I see number one. Portrait of Lily. The one seems to be visible only when the lighthouse shines through the window. Alright. What the fuck was that? Who that? Who that? Be a friend or foe. I suppose uh, even if you're a monster, you're a foe automatically. Wait, hold on. Ah, I see. Number one, what's scratched into the ground for some reason, and it's highlighted by by the freaking lighthouse out there. Okay, that's cool. Okay, that's that's cool. I I, I get it. What is this meant for anyway? Yeah, I have no idea as of yet. Let's look around. Line's dead. There doesn't seem to be any copper wire coming from the wall. Okay, that's that's nice. That's nice. Very nice of that. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, so fancy. Very fancy. I know what people are thinking. What the fuck was that sort of fucking tension supposed to be? I have no idea. I don't think these things through. Oh, safe. Oh. 
Oh, I get it. Okay, uh, how many digits can we enter? One, 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 one. Four digits and, uh, four circles. Okay, that makes sense. So we just have to click on things until the numbers appear on the ground. Is that it? Yeah, that must be it. Okay, and seeing as we're a detective turned private investigator, we must investigate shit. What shit we must investigate, I do not know, but this seems to be a good place to start. Has a seven scratched onto the handle? Does it? Does it? Really? I, oh, yeah, there it is. Okay, that's cool. That's nice. Very nice. And we got a seven scratched here. Now we just have to find the other two numbers. I'd imagine this guest bedroom was beautiful before the incident. What incident? We already know that uh, Lily is missing. We don't know that there's an incident. Although there is blood on the duvet, so it does appear that there was some incident. But then again, that could be anything. That could be red dye. That could be nail polish. Possibly. I'm just trying to remain optimistic here. Can we go in this? Locked? That's the way you came in, you fucking potato. Ah, never mind. Ooh, is there going to be some spooky scare in here? Oh my god, I'm a ghost. Or a vampire. One or the other. Okay, we got a pooper, always good to have. You know, just in case we need to take a dump, take a piss, whichever. Got a moldy old painting here. And... And wait. Oh, paper. We ran away together today, and he surprised me with this place. The sounds coming from the ocean. The piercing blue light from the lighthouse makes me feel at home, even though home is far away from me now. It's as though if the light is a song that only plays for us and doesn't skip a beat. I'll call home tomorrow to let them know I'm safe. Okay, I'm guessing that's from Lily, is it? I want to see a number 9 up there. Yeah, that is a number 9, okay. We must investigate that. Okay, one seven nine. I suppose we could guess the rest of the combination, but who knows? It could be in a particular order. It might be one seven nine something. It could be nine one seven something or one seven nine something. So I guess I'll have to do more investigations. Is there anything behind the door? There's nothing I missed here. What? Jesus Christ! What the fuck? Oh. Well, why didn't that happen the first time? Who that? Oh dear, someone's crying. Oh no. When someone cries, that means they're sad. No, don't be sad. Don't be sad. It's okay. I think it's okay. Hopefully everything will be okay. Maybe. I'm a very positive guy. Stop the crying. Oh. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Brace yourselves. Clench them butt cheeks. Something scary is going to run past here. That's a regular horror trope in these indie games. Boo! No? No? Nothing? Nada? Okay! <laughs> well, that is just fantastic. Jesus, the painting is fucking creepy as hell, boy. Okay. Um. Um. Is there anything here? 
you two will pay. Okay. That's nice. That's very nice. Nothing else was scratched on here. No. Wait, hold on. What's this? A piece of the photo of a pretty red-headed lady. I have to assume that's Lily. Okay. Open inventory. Uh, how do I do that? I? Oh, see. Um. Four of man. A. I am members. Um, how do I do this? Wait, hold on. F to move. Oh, and F to place. Ah, there we go. Oh, and I heard the scratching of something. Okay, 179. Two people. Hmm. I'll try one seven nine two. One seven nine two. Okay, that ain't right. Wait, hold on. I got an idea. It's in a particular order, so I'm assuming that lighthouse will shine on that order. Will it? S okay, seven. Nine. One and two. Okay. All right. Seven nine one two. Then again, that might not be the right order, but I'll give it a chance. Seven nine one two. Oh, bingo! I am a genius. Okay, room key. Oh, f f fucking Jesus Christ! Okay, who's ringing at this hour? Hello? Is that you, Jenkins? I just want to know one thing. Okay. Look at me! God damn it. Okay. Oh no, someone's sad again. Someone's crying. Who's sad? Oh God! Yeah, hey, kid, this is getting creepy. Okay, she's gonna turn around to do the oogie boogie. You just watch. Okay, lady, but I just gotta tell you one thing. You got a nice ass. Okay, I'm complimenting you, so you can't be mad at me. And you got pretty black hair. But more importantly, a nice ass. Oh god! <laughs> what the fuck was that? Wait. Okay, that's that was new. So what did you drop? What did you draw here? A peculiar photo of a yellow flower. Doesn't look that peculiar. I think it looks pretty. I think it looks very artsy. So is that it? I'm assuming I can go through this door now even though I'm pretty sure this is the door I entered through. Okay, use key. Oh wait, that's it? Oh, come on, that's way too short. Okay, coming soon. Steam, Xbox One, and PS4. Now, this is definitely different from a lot of indie thrillers or indie horror games. Because, you know, normally have the, the typical indie horror tropes, typical predictable jump scares, very similar storylines. But, uh,. This seems rather unique in that in that sense. Rather, it's not going for the whole horror approach, but rather thriller. And horror and thriller, they're slightly different. Just ever so slightly different, and I can't wait for this game to come out. And who knows, maybe I'll pick it up when it does, but there's so many good games coming out this year, I mightn't even have the money for it. 
But I'll try. I'll try to try. I'll give it a chance. And hopefully, as I said at the start, I don't want this game to fade into obscurity like so many others, although I can only give one example, and that is Rides with Strangers. Yeah, anyone remember that game? No, you hop in the car with a creepy, baldy priest, and you have to try not to piss him off so that, so that he won't kill you? That game? Anyone remember? No? No, me neither. I, I, I barely remember that game. I played it a few months ago, and nobody's talked about it since, and there's been barely any updates to it. I think the last update to it... Our last update to its Kickstarter, well, I won't say it was that long ago, it was back in June, I think, but nobody's talking about it anymore, it's just gone. Nobody cares about it anymore. Uh, but either way, I'm just rambling on here. So anyway, guys, you know what to do. If you did like this video, be sure to comment, rate, share, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. So until next time, see ya.